In this video, we will solve this integral right here. And so let's begin. And this problem can be easily solved using the tabular method. Tabular method, we have three columns, sine, derivative, and integral column. The sine column alternates between positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative. The derivative column, we choose which term do we want to take the derivative and which term do we want to take the integral. We can easily take the derivative of x cubed and we can easily take the integral of sine 2x. So we'll put x cubed for the derivative column and sine 2x for the integral column. Next, we take the derivative of x cubed, we get 3x squared. Take the derivative of this term, we get 6x. Likewise, 6x becomes 6 and 6 becomes finally 0. Next, we take the integral of sine 2x, which is going to be negative 1 half cosine 2x. The integral of this term will be negative 1 fourth sine 2x. The integral of this term will be 1 over 8 cosine 2x. And finally, the integral of this piece will be 1 over 16 sine 2x. Next, we'll say positive 1 times x cubed times this piece right here. And we would get negative 1 half x cubed cosine 2x. Next, we say negative 1 times this piece times this piece and we would get 3 over 4 x squared sine 2x next we say positive 1 times 6x times this piece and we would get 3 over 4 x cosine 2x and finally we get negative 1 times 6 times this piece and we would get negative 3 over 8 sine 2x plus c and that's all we need to do for this problem